Uh, on an unrelated matter to my past call, could you transfer me over to LAPD on a matter concerning Venice? Thanks. Hi, can I speak to a district? Oh, sorry. Could I have a... Hi, uh, this is Kurt Kelly. I'm with the Joint Terrorist Task Force with U.S. Marshals and DSS PII. Could I speak to a watch... Uh, dispatch watch supervisor, please. Thank you. Your connection got really garbly, or it's very noisy where I'm at, or both. What is your name again? I'm sorry. Fabulous. Hi, this is Kurt Kelly, K U R T K E L L Y. Um, Sergeant French knows me up in Hollywood, Tim Solomon in Pacific, and many others. <sighs> I'm uh, with the Joint Terrorist Task Force with DSS PII and U.S. Marshals. Um, <sighs> I've had numerous robberies and attempts on my life uh, in the Venice area, and recently there was a hit-and-run car accident on August 7th, where I was put in critical condition in the hospital, and against doctor's orders, I am out looking for that asshole, uh, which has 5ME in the tag, if you can broadcast that. Uh, it was a white Volvo. Um, I'm up in Santa Monica right now. There's a guy in Santa Monica, if you get your um, guys, um, especially the people I've already named, to look at a channel called Live Video Inc. on YouTube. I'm going to post some videos of a guy that could be coming into your area. He's talking about nuclear explosion blowing up buildings here in Los Angeles. It's going to be posted on Live Video Inc. channel in the next couple hours. I'm going to upload it. Plus, there's a video I just shot and notified Santa Monica PD that says, thanks for leaving and talking about the White House. But there's actual footage of this guy talking. He's speaking in Arabic. I've heard him speak in English. He's talking about shitting on the street and people eating his shit. Um, I'm a federal contractor with the State Department Diplomatic Security Services, Protective Intelligence Investigations. Joint Task Force leader is huh, Bradley L. Chester at Chester BL at state.gov. He's running the task force on the street with uh, U.S. Marshals. I'm contracting and consulting. Okay, I've also been robbed several times in Venice. And uh, yeah, earlier today, uh, another theft. No, I actually walked up and approached officers in person to let them know about another major death. But in Venice alone, in the last week or so since I've been out of the hospital, I've lost $3 million in assets. So I'm on record as a federal contractor that if you let any more of these snitch bitches, or here's one that really pissed me off, which is going to have some people before a U.S. Senate subcommittee hearing. I was put in handcuffs in the past month over a fucking misdemeanor wise in L.A. County Jail that I couldn't have committed out in Riverside, San Bernardino, while I was being robbed right in front of the precinct at the substation in Venice. So I want to be on record with LAPD. If I, I, hey, listen, please, if I end up in handcuffs one more time and you don't have a federal order to put me in handcuffs, I will sue this city for no less than 10 trillion fucking dollars. I am a celebrity. I am also with the UN War Crimes Commission. I'm a humanitarian. And if you touch me, I have a broken arm in three spots on my right arm. If one more officer puts hands on me, works for LAPD, when I'm being arrested for shit I didn't do and, and I'm being robbed, 
and you let the robbers get away, I will sue you personally. So make this a global broadcast because I'm coming down to Venice. And one more fucking person steals from me, I will personally put them in a motherfucking body bag if you don't get a unit on site in less than five minutes. I'm a rel relative to the fucking Kennedys. I'm a third generation Kennedy to the White House, and I'll bring secret service up everybody's ass. I'm goddamn angry that you're letting people run me over on streets and rob me and put me in handcuffs in jail for shit I'm not doing. I will burn this city to the ground publicly in a live broadcast. If you don't, don't, I will be real clear, a live broadcast, I'll burn it to the ground on public television with all the news of your crooked cops. I'm not going to light a fire. I'm going to start a fucking riot with the bullshit you people are doing. So correct your fucking problem or I'll correct you.